Hey YouTubers, just here to talk to you about uh, some different options for your magazines while you're out on the range. Uh, I myself uh, shoot AR-15 and this is one of the average AR-15 mags uh, that they have and they are very standard when you're out shooting 15 people in a line and you're dropping magazines um, a lot of times it's hard to tell which one is which uh, even if you write your name on them after a little bit of wear with a sharpie they'll come off um, so a lot of times uh, um, in the military they will put tape on them so they know which one is theirs but that kinda looks kinda gaudy um, and they'll even make their own mag pulls um, but usually it's always OD green so I thought what a good way to distinguish um, your own magazines um, by not only making your own mag pulls which helps helps pull the mag out uh, and also looking down at them if you know it's got a mag pull uh, you know it's your magazine um, but you can do using paracord you can make a little mag pull like this now this is uh, uh, just a generic little mag pull you can use this also for uh, if you wanted to store these you can just hang these on a peg you can have several there so it's actually good for uh, when you're just uh, in your gun safe or uh, you know put a nail in the wall and you want to hang your mags there you can have them fully loaded and ready to go um, but just want to give you one more uh, option for paracord. Uh, this paracord was actually gutted. All you got to do is take the plate off the bottom. The military uses this quite a bit, or, or GIs out there, depending on their own preference. Um, but me being uh, the not tire that I am, not that you would want to accessorize yours like this, but just wanted to show other options for that. This is fairly easy to do, um, especially with some of the knots I've already shown on the channel. But all you got to do is slide the butt plate off. I'm pretty sure that other magazines other than AR uh, probably are similar to this. You can slide in some paracord. Uh, it works great with uh, either paracord that's gutted or regular paracord. Um, so it should fit in there. Take a regular magazine, lace it through just like so and then your own imagination is your limit pretty much uh, I've made a couple just to kinda show what can be done I kinda made that a little bit longer than I should have um, if I were to do that one again I would make it just like that basically that's the uh, bracelet um, weave that everybody does for the paracord bracelets or you know do a little something like this even if you're using just basic paracord and maybe just a little bit of a a splash of color for your own that's enough to distinguish your own magazine out on the range and of course all this paracord that I've got uh, this really cool stuff is all from bucklerunner.com which Buckle Runner gives every, all my viewers 10 percent off uh, for watching all you gotta do is use ddog24 as your coupon code. Uh, right now they're running specials every day uh, giving away something free with every order uh, so it changes every day on the website so if you want to check the website uh, you can see what the next special of the day is and uh, I think even some of the specials will let you uh, uh, pick your paracord color if you're if you know you get a, some free paracord or whatever you get to pick your color. Uh, the specials are every day so check it out but just want to throw some other options out there now maybe you're thinking I would never do that to my magazines hey whatever floats your boat but I wanted to show some people some other options and that's just how you accessorize it with paracord because it always gets better with paracord you guys have a good day thanks for watching until next time hey and if you guys uh, come up with uh, some other little invention some other little knot or something cool shoot me a line I wanna see it thanks